Hello, I am Amy Medfin, a Technical Advisor in Development Operations at Scottish Water. To apply for a water or sewer connection for your new property, the first step will be to submit an application to Scottish Water. On receipt of your application, you'll receive a confirmation response from Development Operations, providing you with your unique reference number. The response will advise that your application has been assigned to a member of the technical team to review or advise if further information is required. Once the assessment has been completed, a member of the technical team will provide you with a technical audit and a quotation for the works. The technical audit issued to you will advise of your responsibilities. Firstly, to hire your chosen competent contractor to carry out the works prior to inspection. If the water or fill main that you are connecting to is within a public footpath or road, you are required to arrange all road opening permits and excavations. OK, Amy, we're going to have a look at this one here. This is a far side connection. OK. So, as you can see, we've got the main exposed here. Right, the 125 main. We've got the water pipe, which has been ducted. OK. So the pipe work is all in and it's all correct. It's the correct depth, a minimum we need 750. Just a bit more digging out to do and that's it ready for the actual connection. Okay, so what we're going to look for in here, we're going to look, make sure that the hand valve, which is fitted, so we've got the hand valve, we've got a double check valve and fitted as well. So that's exactly what Scottish Water is looking for. Scottish Water has very, very high standards as to what we will accept as a track inspection and what we'll obviously point out as to where we can't have it. We need to make sure that we can get the connection done safely in accordance with health and safety rule and that there's no other utility services blocking the way for us to get that connection done. When a customer asks us for a track inspection, we require a couple of things. More importantly, the proper depth. A minimum there is 750 or maximum 1000. So the service is not going to burst if there's any heavy traffic going over it. More importantly, it's not going to burst again with the permafrost. Once the inspection has been completed, and if the inspector confirms it's a Scottish water standard and in line with the technical audit, the main department will arrange for the water connection to be completed within 10 working days. If for any reason it will take longer than 10 working days, a member of the team will contact you to advise. After the sewer inspection, if the inspector confirms it's a Scottish water standard, your contractor can carry out the sewer connection. So now you know the process, let's hear from a Scottish Water customer who has a personal experience organising a single connection. When I contacted Scottish Water and I spoke to someone, they went through all the things that I would need to do the process. They sent me out some leaflets, some information that I needed um, to manage my expectation of timelines and so on. It's quite a complex process that they have to follow to ensure public safety, so yeah, I do feel that I got really good service.